guys, welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to make some meatloaf with um, Filipino twist. Okay, so I have this two pounds of lean ground beef. First thing first is I'm going to add my three small eggs. Okay, we're going to use three because it's just small eggs. So this is what we're going to do. Okay. Next, we're going to use steak seasoning. We're not going to add any salt because steak seasonings already have a lot of salt in it. So, oh, a tablespoon, a tablespoon of onion powder. Okay. Garlic powder. Black pepper. Even though the steak seasonings already have black pepper, I still want to add some more uh, black pepper. Okay, then a cup of oatmeal. Okay, and we're going to mix this. Make sure you mix it really well so that all the seasoning are mixed to the meat and, of course, the oatmeal. Okay, so we're done mixing. So I'm going to taste just a little bit the meat. You need a little bit um, steak seasoning, just a little bit. I like to taste before cooking to make sure that it's really well balanced and well seasoned, okay? Okay, so this is done. We're gonna put this aside for now, for like five minutes. Okay guys, so what we're going to do, I have this in the foil because this um, meatloaf, we have to wrap it and bake it. So first thing first, I'm gonna remove this, okay. So we are going to put our meat in a little foil. Okay, and you know what? I am gonna use my hand. My fingernails is really, really short because I like to use my fingers. So I just want you to know it's clean. Okay, so we're going to flatten the meat. Okay. Make sure it's really even. Okay. So next we're gonna add a fresh carrots spread all over the meat okay so I chopped some carrots just like that I like fresh um, I wish I have some celery but I don't have any green vegetables I I didn't go to the store yet, so we're just gonna use this, okay? So I'm gonna push it to the meat. Then I'm gonna spray some, a little bit of seasoning, because remember we season our uh, meat, but of course the, um, the vegetables need a um, seasoning. Okay, then we're gonna put some sausage some people, they put hot dogs. I preferred sausage because sausage is really well seasoned in it. So, um, just gonna spray this, okay? Just like that. Mm, maybe this one here, right there. So I only have one sausage, so I add one. Next, we're going to do, 
this one. I have boiled eggs. Okay, just like that. We're gonna put some boiled eggs in the middle. There we go. Like what I said, it's a Filipino meatloaf. Okay, so next we're going to cover this. We're gonna wrap it. Okay, just like that. Cover. I'm gonna take this out. Okay, then I'm gonna turn this way. So that way it can be really made in the middle and sealed. Okay, so here, then we're going to open again just to make sure that it really sealed the, the middle um, meat, not meat, but the eggs and all the healthy. Um, So now, is we're going to wrap, as you can see, so I'm going to turn around, okay. So I'm going to add one more, add for um, aluminum foil, okay, there we go. This one here. We make sure that's really sealed. Now we're gonna bake this for an hour, okay, for 375 degrees. Okay, so we're going to roll it just like that, okay. Make sure it's really okay. And then the edges, we're going to twist. Make sure it's really sealed. Okay. okay. So again, we're gonna bake this for an hour, for 375, okay. So stay tuned guys. So I just get it out from the oven guys. So extremely, extremely hot. So we're going to get this out. So our Filipino meatloaf, it's done. So I did cook for an hour. Now it depends the size of your meatloaf. So you can cook a little bit longer but just to make sure that it's really cooked, okay? What's up? Okay, there we go, guys. It's hot. So I'm going to get this out. Take this aluminum foil. Oh wow, it's hot. Okay, so this is what the Filipino meat loves. So I'm going to slice it. Mmm, so good. I'm going to slice it, guys, okay? So you can see what it looks like inside. I think I'm going to cut something. There we go. Beautiful. I just... Okay, here's what they look like, the Filipino meatloaf. As you can see, okay, it's a beautiful color. So thank you, thank you so much, guys. I hope you enjoyed this simple recipe. Uh, please subscribe my YouTube channel and don't forget to press notifications. You're going to see all my incoming videos. Thank you so much. May God bless you all. Try this at home. It's so delicious. Meatloaf. I love you guys. Get bless you all. Bye-bye.